through its environmental governance project funded by the government of Sweden. And now in its second year, the UNDP has provided crucial support to small-scale miners across five hotspot regions. One such community is the Hobohobo Small-Scale Miners Cooperative at Uis in the Daris constituency of the Erongo region, which mines dimension stones such as prenite, amethyst and tantalum, among others. According to UNDP resident representative Al Kabatia, the project aims to enhance the livelihoods and safety of small scale miners by offering comprehensive health and safety training and fostering sustainable mining practices. One of the other objectives that we have is also to promote uh, more women coming in. So it's a traditionally a male dominated field, but there are some women miners as well. And we would like to in, encourage women miners who are currently almost, uh, I mean, uh, at 10% uh, of the uh, small scale miners. So they can come up because women um, are also some of the households are headed by women and they, they do provide for their families. Ministry of Mines and Energy Deputy Executive Director Erasmus Shivolo noted that the successful completion of this project marks a significant milestone in the collaboration, demonstrating a shared commitment to fostering sustainable and legally compliant mining practices in Namibia. The group received first aid, sustainable mining training and personal protective equipment on Friday. Chairperson of the Hobohobos Miners Cooperative, Alfred Lucas, on behalf of other miners, welcomed the training and assistance, adding that it will further enhance their efforts and understanding in improving their livelihoods while maintaining sustainable mining. Congenia Binga reporting for Primetime News.